If relationships equal time and time equals relationships, then be creative in spending time with your kids. Unusual situations that will give you a freedom to talk. Now I'm just going to, in a few segments, share with you some of the things that I've done. But remember, I wasn't creative enough to come up with all this. I stole them from other people. I watched other fathers. I read everything I could that would give me an advantage with my child. For example, one thing you could do, sleep in the backyard, get a couple sleeping bags with your son or daughter and uh, say, well, let's sleep outdoors tonight. And I'll tell you, you do that. You, if you don't take a, you know, an iPod with you or anything else or your cell phone, you will have conversation time you never dreamed of in the backyard. Another thing, now this is what I did, and I've shared this once before, but we were fortunate to have a, a family give us a spa, a jacuzzi for our master bedroom. Oh, was it hard getting it into there. But we had it set up. And so one night I said, you know, I gotta be creative with that uh, jacuzzi. So I said, kids, get ready and get in the jacuzzi. I'll be right with you. I went out in the kitchen and I started popping some popcorn. My wife says, what are you doing? I said, we're gonna have popcorn. Did you she said, you can't do that. I said, why not? Well, nobody ever, well, why can't we do it? So I put it in a big aluminum bowl. Now, if you have a jacuzzi, this is great. I put it in a big aluminum bowl and we put it in the center with the jets on. It would spin around and we sat there as a family eating popcorn out of the bowl and just had times to talk, converse, everything. Another thing, have you ever kidnapped your child at school? No, I'm serious. Show up just before the break, clear it with the teachers and take your child right out of the class and go do something special that they like and kidnap them from school and even get permission to hold them out from one class for one hour because any teacher would know an hour with a daddy is far better than an hour in the classroom. But be sure to do things that they like. One father came to me and he said, it doesn't work. I said, what? Going out and doing things with my son. I said, yes, it does. No, it does. He said, give me an example. I said, well, we went out and uh, played golf and it was awful. All we did was argue and everything else and he complained. I said, hmm. I said, does your son like to golf? He said, no. I said, what does your son like to do? All he wants to do is play basketball. I said, why didn't you go out and play basketball with him? You know what the father said? I don't like basketball. Look, don't go out and do things that you like. Step into your child's world and do things that they like. That's when the relationships are formed. Uh, do unusual things to build time with your children.